Yeah, so this is a trial now in metastatic setting. And the idea behind this trial is that maybe there are patients in metastatic setting that we are under treating with standard approaches. And we know that from other diseases like lung cancer, we have, we have also results from phase two studies that look at oligometastatic states across disease types where there are some patients who have limited number of metastatic sites that benefit from the addition of radiation to all these sites to systemic therapy. And so, um, although the studies that were enrolled patients across disease types were positive, they are hypothesis generating. So we are trying to ask the question of whether the role of consolidated radiation therapy in oligometastatic gastric and esophageal patients is also relevant specifically for this disease. And so this is an ongoing phase three cooperative group trial that enrolls patients with oligometastatic gastroesophageal adenocarcinoma. Patients are treated with about four months of first-line chemotherapy and immunotherapy if they have the appropriate biomarkers. And those patients whose disease does not progress on this therapy are subsequently randomized either to consolidated radiation therapy to all sides of disease followed by systemic therapy, or they continue to standard systemic chemotherapy, which is standard practice. And the primary endpoint of the study is overall survival. I'm hoping this is going to be a practice change in study and that we show that we can further improve the outcomes of these patients. But of course, we'll have to see what the results of the studies are in the future.